Hello and welcome to this Fast Track How To video. Today I'm going to show you how to set and assign the cutouts. Let's take a look. Cutouts can be programmed to enable or disable a function based on another preset tractor function. To access the cutout settings, first go into the main tractor settings page, then select the cutout icon. The front and rear PTO can be stopped and started using the linkage height setting. Select a required percentage setting, then click save. Turn the PTO on using the main control switch and operate the linkage. The PTO will stop and start as seen on the screen. Four-wheel drive and diff lock can be turned on and off using the following programs. Speed and steer angle. To adjust one of these programs, select the icon and use the plus and minus icons. Then click save. In this example, four-wheel drive will cut out based on a 20% steer angle. To enable this function, both the four-wheel drive and auto buttons need to be selected on the B-pillar. The four-wheel steer user settings allows the steering to be automatically controlled based on either an external trigger switch, the front and rear linkage, speed or steer angle. To set a linkage height for example, select the rear linkage icon, then use the plus and minus icons to set a height, then click save. Now in four-wheel steer user mode, when the linkage is lowered to its set point, it will operate in two-wheel steer. When the linkage is raised above the height, it will revert to four-wheel steer. The second steering cutout setting is for GPS. When GPS is engaged using one of the joystick buttons, the tractor will automatically revert to two-wheel steer. When the GPS is disengaged, the steering will revert back to four-wheel steer. Thank you for watching this Fast Track how-to video. Please remember, always refer to your operator's manual for more details. Join us again next time for another Fast Track How To.